President-elect Donald Trump has made a renewed commitment to addressing the issue of homelessness among American veterans, sharply criticizing the current administration for its approach to immigration and resource allocation. During a recent speech, Trump alleged that under President Joe Biden's administration, the federal government has prioritized providing housing for illegal immigrants over addressing the needs of homeless veterans. He claimed that nearly $1 billion has been spent on housing migrants in expensive luxury hotels, while thousands of veterans remain homeless and living in poor conditions on American streets. Meanwhile, we have 33,000 veterans in this country who are homeless, and living very poorly I might add, Trump said. They're living in filth and squalor on our streets. Nobody is doing a thing for them. He criticized the Biden administration for what he described as a disgraceful abandonment of efforts to support veterans, efforts which he said were strengthened during his presidency. Trump highlighted his administration's record on veteran care, mentioning improvements at the Department of Veterans Affairs and other initiatives, though he did not provide specific examples of programs aimed at veteran homelessness. He pledged that, upon taking office, he would take immediate action to redirect federal funds away from services for undocumented immigrants and towards supporting homeless veterans. On day one, I will sign an executive order to cut off Joe Biden's massive spigot of funding for shelter and transport of illegal aliens and redirect a portion of those savings, a very large portion I might add, to provide shelter and treatment for homeless American veterans, Trump said. He further promised to make it a personal mission to eliminate veteran homelessness by the end of his upcoming term. Trump's remarks also included broader criticisms of the Biden administration, touching on topics like border security, energy independence, and the economy. He linked these issues to his broader vision of prioritizing American citizens, particularly veterans, over what he described as illegal alien lawbreakers. The speech has drawn a mixed response. Supporters have praised the emphasis on veterans' issues, a group often lauded for their service but still struggling with significant challenges, including homelessness and access to mental health care. Critics, however, argue that Trump's rhetoric on immigration could exacerbate divisions and question whether his proposed funding reallocations would address the systemic causes of veteran homelessness. The Department of Housing and Urban Development, HUD, and the Department of Veterans Affairs, VA, have not yet responded to Trump's comments. According to recent data, efforts to combat veteran homelessness have seen some progress in recent years, though challenges remain, particularly in the wake of the COVID-19 pandemic. Trump's vow to end veteran homelessness by the end of his next term will be something to watch closely, as questions remain about whether his proposed solutions can gain bipartisan support or deliver meaningful change.